It's your boy Noto. Coming to you with more videos. Coming to you with more content, man. And in today's video, we're gonna talk about you need to get out and get around the women that you want to attract, bro. Like, honestly, like I say, like one of the biggest battles, like today, like a lot of dudes just don't go outside. A lot of dudes ain't really outside. They they they're doing a lot of swiping and they're not really getting outside to really experience these things, like. You guys, you gotta go. You gotta go outside and be around these women. Get find out where they at. Like, bro, like, what do you what do you expect to just get from just swiping? You're not most likely you're not going to end up meeting up with the chick, and then you always end up getting some surprise. But when you meet them in person, every all, most of that ice is already broken. They already see you in person. See what I'm saying? When they already see you in person, they already see your demeanor they already can map out whether they want you or not or something like that or whether you want them or not or uh, what type of women that you want to be around and a lot of this stuff is based upon i noticed that a lot of the chicks that end, i end up being around like the chicks that i end up hooking up with you end up having to be around them guys you got to be around them like they the more they see you the more comfortable they come they they become around you guys the more comfortable they that you make them the more receptive they are to you. So most likely, if it's a chick that you see every day, most likely she's going to be more receptive to talk to you and be around you and, and end up putting you in positions that you would want to be in. Like, you feel me? So, like, and the thing is, like, if you go to school with her, most likely she's going to see you every day. So y'all going to be around each other for the most part. So when you, when you, the whole thing about this, guys, is being around. When you around, there's things that can happen because, dudes, you can grow on that shit. There's, there's a type of thing you can grow on her. She might not even want you at first, but just being around you for all this time can have you to grow on her. You know what I'm saying? So you never know. like, Because a lot of this stuff, like the opportunities that I had with dances and stuff like that, if I just went to the college and just been a hermit and just stayed in my room, that would have never happened. But me being around them, being in the band and being around, going to the cafeteria, going and participating in activities, led me to be around the women that I wanted to, that I really wanted. Instead of just seeing them at pet rider saying, ooh, I want her, and just go back in my room and don't do nothing. Don't go out to any festivities. Don't do nothing. Guys, you got to get out there. Be around, like the chicks that you work with or something like that. They, they can get more comfortable around you too. So you get a job, you work around a lot of, a lot of women. Most likely they go to be able to see how you are. They already like that you're grinding because you're already working. So that's out the window. They know that you got a job, that you're doing something at least. So you around a lot of the work because I know you're pretty much checking out some women that you're working with or whatever you got going on. So when you out there, the more that you're around, you you just grow on them, and you can you can make your moves. It, everything is a probably just most likely go more smoother because of that. You feel me, guys? When you're in that space, when you're in a space that you can interact with them daily, and you can see them on a on a daily basis, and you can see them more often, more frequently, that opens the door for more things that would have never happened if you ain't put yourself in that situation in the first place. If you ain't go out and put yourself around these people so you can gauge and see, feel how it is to be around them and get and let them feel how it is to be around you and build up a certain level of, of being comfortable around you 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 know what i'm saying it wouldn't have been it wouldn't be you feel me so just, just sitting in the house and being a keyboard warrior and and being brave on these dating sites ain't ain't, ain't the same you guys got to get outside so when you gotta go, you gotta go outside to meet the women that you wanna meet. Find out where they hang out at. You go hang out. You know what I'm saying? But my thing is, it's not like this. Just go just for them. You you might end up finding women that you that you like doing your own hobbies. Doing your own hobbies. You you'll end up you'll be surprised who you run into when you just going on your own adventure, bro. Go look at your city. Find out what uh kind of festivities are going on. Maybe it's something of your interest. Don't just go just because the women's there. But at the same time, you end up having yourself a good time. So that way that you're already comfortable, you're not always dependent upon whether they're there or not. But you're out there anyway. So most likely you're going to meet somebody. You're going to see somebody that get, grabs your interest, especially when there's a gathering of people coming together, especially when there's music and drinks and food involved. More, more than likely, you want to see tricks that you want. So putting yourself around them and probably making that a, a routine you know, because when you're grinding, you might want to kick back and you want to you want to have some fun. It's nothing wrong with that, guys. So you need to put yourself in, in environments where you can meet these chicks, where you can be around. And maybe a lot of this 
the snobby, thinking that these women are snobby, that you really want, that you feel like they're the real bad, aren't really so bad. Maybe we just meet, meet them and go have a conversation with them. Instead of just sitting back from the date and having thought, oh yeah, she probably, she probably this and that. Oh, she probably snobby. Oh, she, she got her nose poked up or something. You never know. That chick could probably be the coolest chick that, she could be down to earth. Bro, I done met some down to earth ass dimes. Real shit. Especially like uh, the, the Zetas from the uh, college and shit, bro. Those are some of the coolest females I done met. Bad as fuck too. Some of the coolest females I done met. Those chicks are bad, bro. You just go up to them and just, just bro, have a good conversation, bro. You never know where that shit can go. You don't even gotta be trying to flirt or none of that. Just chill and have a good conversation. You never know where that shit will go. You feel me? So, this your boy Noto. Coming to you more videos. Coming to you more content, guys. And remember, guys, anybody can improve themselves if they're willing to work at it. I'm out.